Welcome to the Beginner's Guide to Kyla Kowalskia. Behold one of Hololive's greatest endurance streamers, the calm and diligent blacksmith who loves Mondays and the number 69. For Kyla, the grind never stops. Kyla's streaming stamina is outstanding, and especially if she's playing Minecraft, expect that stream to approach 12 hours. It is not uncommon for viewers who have to go to sleep during his streams to then wake up only to see that Kyla is still streaming. You can stop the grind! The grind never stops! Kyla is stoic and steady, as well as very cool. And yet, like Crony and Kali, this only accentuates her god Moe. Turns out she's also quite cute and adorable. <laughs> ah, and who can forget her iconic laugh? No, she's not muted. That's just her silent laugh. You'll get used to it. It's part of her charm. If her model does this and you hear no sound, always assume she is laughing. Kyla is a gamer through and through. Movies? You can't grind in those. Games are therefore superior. Back to grinding we go. And I mean it. For this blacksmith has been tempered and forged in the toxic wastes of Summoner's Rift, unmoved and unconcerned by whatever toxicity may be flung her way. Likewise, she's completely unimpressed at horror games. She's even apologized for not getting scared at jump scares! I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry! <laughs> With that said, even someone as calm, cool and collected like Kyla will break if pushed to the absolute limit. <laughs> And then there's Goriella. <laughs> Ferocious. Whoops, now she's baby. But I cannot state it enough. Kyla's grinding habits are quite infamous amongst any who know of her. She absolutely devours the Hololive fan games. Holocure, Holodive, Delivering Hope. None are a match for the mighty Kyla. Their devs fear her name. I pray for you, game devs, who have become slaves to Kyla's endless hunger. <laughs> And now, I welcome you to Kyla's Dominion, Minecraft. Funnily enough, she was still a newbie when she streamed Minecraft for the first time, with Muna showing her the ropes. Ever since then, Kyla has become possibly the greatest Minecraft NPC powerhouse in all of the branches of Hololive. One that awes even the most skilled veterans, like her very own NPC teacher Muna herself. Even the Minecraft master, the war criminal, has kneeled down wishing to become Kyla's disciple. She's completely addicted. She practically lives in the nether, and any new update will be completely devoured by her in a short amount of time. Here, in the whole server, you may be awed and amazed as you bear witness to the multitude of her creations. The underground storage, the lava factory, the mushroom island and its underwater villa, and of course, Kyla's temple, and let's not forget the netherite beacon, built with over 5,900 netherite, the rarest material in Minecraft, among many, many others. Indeed, Kyla's wealth in the server is vast, a bounty comparable to the great ancient kings of the likes of Mansa Musa, and she's not afraid to flex it either. Yes, that is Kyla just casually building with a very disposable diamond blocks. This is an Elytra, a rare endgame item that is very sought after for its ability to allow one to soar the skies. It's very valuable, and every member who has it holds their one copy as one of their most prized possessions. Which, of course, means Kyla has an entire room filled with dozens upon dozens of them. Wait! <laughs> How many hours have you spent in this game? And she simply hands them over to visitors, like some common souvenir. Take a hold! <laughs> she gives a light Indeed! Her treasure is one of endless abundance, and even greater is the Queen's generosity. For if any member has ever a need for something, it is to Kyla who they should go for. Kyla refuses no one and always delivers in greater amounts. For this, Kyla has cultivated a legendary reputation amongst all in the Minecraft server, regardless of branch. Her kindness and generosity have won her the hearts of many a fellow member, now being worshipped as a Minecraft goddess. Her temple, which was created as a means to aid her fellow members, 
to keep them motivated to play the game in case they send loss or need a lot of materials for their own personal projects often sees many visitors and in it your faith shall be rewarded with all that you wish for merely put in a request and in a matter of days your wish shall become a reality ho oh, ho you ask for a few sea lanterns you mean a hundred stacks one stack of gold ingots? Nah, take a full crate! The Queen's generosity knows no bounds, so here, take three full shulker boxes of quartz bot stacks! Want one overpowered diamond pickaxe? Take two instead! Plus a few more valuable bonuses for good measure! You ask Kyla for something, she will give you a hundred times more! If you dare say the words many many, and she really will give you many many, those words are dangerous! Kyla is good! What is it? Forsooth! Bask in the love and generosity of the great Kyla, goddess of abundance! With this, she has earned herself quite a number of very faithful believers, including the harem master Nekomata Okayu, who herself has become a priestess to the Kyla religion. However, so much adoration can also spark fear as much as awe in the hearts of others, and with Kyla so effortlessly building up her harem, another harem builder begins to feel challenged. Enter Kureiji Oli, the lovely number one zombie idol and Kyla senpai. Seeing her kohai come up and absolutely amaze everyone so hard has sparked a rivalry among the two, although quite one-sided. Oli declared war on Kyla, but often gets comedically foiled, proceeding to suffer mental damage by Kyla simply going about her business as normal. Of course she gets more bitches than me! One time, Oli stole one of Kyla's ancient debris and hid it under a carpet. Unsurprisingly, Kyla found out about it and proceeded to hide around a dozen more under that same carpet. Three months later, Oli was horrified. Don't tell me. Now that's a traumatic flex! Memang, rifle aku itu. Curse you, Kyla Kowalski! On the other side of the spectrum, you have Koseki Biju, at the time of this video's making, a more recent addition to Hololive's roster. While Biju was initially scared, she quickly got under Kyla's guiding wing. Ever since then, the two have become close friends and, ah, oh, it absolutely melts my heart. They're like mother and daughter. Have a taste of some sugar! One time, Bijou was having technical difficulties, leading to losing her PAL world account. Kyla proceeded to end her stream early to play with Bijou, so she wouldn't feel sad anymore. This right here has got to be one of my favorite duos in Hololive. They even speak about each other in the same way. Today, she was like, Kyla, I'm home! Call up when? And she was like, Bijou, I'm back! Call up when? Ah, it just puts a smile on one's face. My soul. Kyla is a very hard-working individual with great insight and experience backing her up. She is a very kind-hearted soul who absolutely loves both games and streaming. In fact, early in her whole life career, she still worked at an office job simultaneously, and even then, she still did the long stream she does today. How did she find the time to sleep then? See, that's the funny part. She didn't. Yeah, sometimes I just didn't sleep, sometimes I just skipped that because I just want to stream so bad. That's how much she loved streaming games, even whilst working another job. Fortunately, those days are in the past and she's now able to stream full time as a proud member of Hololive, doing what she loves most. When asked how she didn't burn out, she simply answered. I've been dreaming for this so long. I've been do several different jobs before this there's nothing that i can be like more great grateful than this you know life is good a blacksmith who perfected their craft and yet was left unsatisfied missing an important rare ingredient after looking long enough she finally found her missing ingredient in hololive for the missing ingredient she finally found in hololive was happiness it's the happiness and so the great blacksmith continues working diligently as always May her hammer strike true, may she wield it with wisdom, and may she continue smiling as she keeps on grinding. The grind never stops! Thank you for watching. Consider grinding the subscribe button and leave a Jidon, my soul! In the comments! Otsuremao!